Now let's head back out to Marty Bass, who is working for a good cause this morning. Yes, truly, Marty. We love these stories. Tell us where you are and what you're up to. Well, this is a great story. And first off, Meg, Cena, Tim, everyone, good morning. TGI, if everybody, it's absolutely the truth. Hope you're doing quite well at this time. Oliver Gray with Guinness, Kelly Talent with the Baltimore Ravens. It's all about the Maryland Food Bank. Let me just say what's behind us before we talk, guys, sure. okay? What you're seeing in the very, very back of the shot are empty boxes, about 8,600 of them. You see a lot of long tables. They're identically stocked with food products. Over the course of the day, what do you think, Kelly? 400 people or just around that number? Close to 400 people will be volunteering. Yeah, 400 volunteers, not just people, mm -hmm. uh, for this food drive benefiting the Maryland Food Bank. Oliver, why does Guinness jump on this? Well, um, Guinness, uh, working with the community is in our DNA. Uh, we were founded 263 years ago, and Arthur Guinness uh, really got in the community in Dublin, and so we're just extending that out into our community here in Baltimore. And the, the food bank's 1.5 miles away, so they're literal neighbors. Yeah, I was going to say, K2 and I have been to the Maryland Food Bank. It's just literally right down Route 1. Now, you guys started organizing, you're working on this maybe with Guinness and the Maryland Food Bank last winter. Yes, we actually, this last winter was our first time participating in this, but we have been working with the Food Bank for 27 years yeah, now with the, our, our Food and Funds Drive, yes. You know, that was one of Art Modell's real key points. He, Pat, David, John, they were like, this team has to become a part of the community. More than just wearing merch, more than just selling concessions, more than just selling PSLs, more than just playing football. And that's why it's been going for over a quarter of a century. Hey, listen, we're going to take a break, come right back, and talk more about what is going to make Thanksgiving happen for thousands and thousands of people dealing with the worst. In my mind, food insecurity is one of the worst problems you could ever, ever want to deal with. So we'll be back and we'll talk more shortly. It's a great day to be here again. It's back to you.